Hello friends. In this video we will discuss the most important and most asked multiple choice questions in the exam of SSC Junior Engineer Civil Engineer. Let's start. Welcome to our channel. Civil Engineering Basics. For more videos please subscribe, Civil Engineering Basics. The rock which shows great variation in water yielding capacity is, sandstone. Overlap in aerial photography refers to the same ground features taken from two camera positions. The meander pattern of a river is developed by dominant discharge. Which type of cross-section can attain yield moment but not the plastic moment before failure by plate buckling? Semi-compact section type of cross-section can attain yield moment but not the plastic moment before failure by plate buckling. To avoid shearing, dam has to be placed as far as possible from faults. Which of the following class of pre-stressed concrete bridge attribute to allow flexural tensile stress without any visible cracking? Class 2 pre-stressed concrete bridge attribute to allow flexural tensile stress without any visible cracking. In the moment distribution method, the distribution factor for the end span on the fixed end side is zero. Muskingum's method is connected to which of the following? Muskingum's method is connected to flood routing. In all groundwater exploration programs, one of the main objectives is to locate free attic water zone.
What is the value of partial safety factor for shop fabricated welds? 1.25 Correction due to Sagaba tape is always positive. Which of following code is useful for bridge designing? Mark 6 code is useful for bridge designing. Of the following four sections, which section has the maximum plastic modulus? ISHB 250 Which of the following is not a direct method of discharge measurement in a stream? Slope area method is not a direct method of discharge measurement in a stream. The latitude of a line is, the projection of the line on the north-south meridian. An electric pole 5 meters high is fixed into the foundation. It carries a wire at the top and is free to move sideways. The effective length of the pole is 4 meters. Available moisture in soil can be computed as the field capacity minus permanent wilting point. A flood of certain magnitude has a return period of 25 years. The probability of exceedance is 4%. A T-beam behaves as a rectangular beam of width equal to its flange if its neutral axis remains within the flange.
The super passage is a hydraulic structure in which the natural stream passes over the irrigation canal. Thank you so much for viewing this video. For more video on civil engineering subscribe my channel. Civil Engineering Basics